guys and welcome to my channel. I'm Amanda and we are here with a poppy painting. I did one a couple of months ago because it was Remembrance Day in America. So I decided to do one for the UK since, uh, you know, I am from the UK. So yeah. I think that it's really important to remember who fought for you in the past and to respect them. I don't think that we should be spending as much money as we are on monuments and stuff for them. Um, I think that that money should go to soldiers now or to uh, other things rather than remembering statues all across the land. They're spending a lot of money on it. but. It's a way to remember them and a way to solidify the history. So with this poppy painting, I decided to do it a little bit more illustrative than uh, realistic. Like in my last poppy painting, I did a little bit more realistic than this. Um, but I wanted to do one that was cast in sunlight. The reference photo is from pmp-art.com. What a surprise, I get most of my reference photos from there and I do love them. Unless I've taken the photo of myself, which is occasional, I do take the photo myself occasionally if I go anywhere because I am a keen photographer. I was on the phone while I was doing this so I wasn't really paying much attention. I was just having fun. I'm using Schmincke paints by the way and I'm also using the Dela Rooney smooth watercolour paper. It's my favourite watercolour paper although I do like the texture the textured ones a lot as well. I just love the way that these colours flow together and I love the colour combination. Red, orange and yellow is pretty much my favourite combination of colours and I just love the way that it looks and the paint, because it's such high quality paint, was just so easy to use. It was such a joy to just relax and chill out and talk to my friend while I painted this. I was also a lot more patient than I usually am with this watercolour so I did wait for it to dry a lot but I still got some runs because I am a little bit more impatient than what I should be with watercolour. Also towards the end of the watercolour painting I do use gouache. It is really in expensive cheap gouache and I really need to get myself a better set just so that I could put extra details in there. Details that I wouldn't have been able to get with watercolour unless I used masking fluid. I just really love this painting because it's so bright and vibrant and happy looking. It just makes me smile when I see it. I am going to sell this on my Red Bubble store if you would like to get any prints or stickers or anything like that but I need to scan it into the computer first and I do not have a scanner at the moment so I'm going to have to do it at my mum's house um, but I will be in my Red Bubble store. I haven't officially re released that store yet but I will be doing that soon um, so I will make a video all about that Red Bubble stuff but I obviously need to make enough stuff first. I decided to deepen the background quite a bit 
um, and I don't know if this was a good idea or not. I wanted it to look like there was a lot of stuff in the background and in shadow, um, but I think that I went too far with the colours at the same time. I shouldn't have put greens with reds and yellows, it just didn't work very well. But I'm still really happy with the way that this came out. It's just so colourful and loose and I actually really love this painting. Um, I don't know if I've said that far too much, but I do. The stem though was a little bit, nah. I, I couldn't get the stem the way that I wanted it to, but it doesn't matter, it's fine. It, it looks cool. Sorry about the random bursts of smoky stuff that you can see. I still vape and I really do want to quit, but I can't seem to do that at the moment. Like I said, I tried to make this a lot more illustrative than I would make it. Uh, realistic so I didn't put as much detail in it as I could have but that's the way that I wanted it to go. Anyway guys, this video is coming to a close. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you did your one minute silence, two minute silence for uh, Remembrance Day on Friday. It's Remembrance Sunday today. It kind of is like a long weekend thing. Um, but yeah, I'm happy with this. I hope that you enjoyed watching me paint it. Please remember to comment, like and subscribe and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.